Okay. So this is going to be an interesting day. There's something happening on this stream that I've never done before, really. Um, testing to see how it works. Seeing how I like it. So well, let's go over what's happening. Uh, I've been watching a lot of infomercials. It's better than TV. Uh, I actually think that a lot of infomercials are more interesting and more entertaining than television. Or movies. So I've been on a big kick of it. I get on a kick of watching infomercials. Every maybe once a year or two. So I figured, if I'm on the kick right now, there's so much shit to dissect in these videos and in these products. I kind of want to like, I, if, it, if I'm not going to, I'm going to watch them in bed anyways. Uh, and some of these, some of these products are insane. And some of them are just fun to watch. But anyways, I want, a, I, I got a lot of infomercials here. Some of these, have, I've seen these before. And I want to go over these products with you. And uh, by the way, some of these are like 10 to 20 years old, so. They may have been some new innovations since then. I mean, I'm on, there's like 200 videos in this playlist. So, I mean, and I, I know I just like leaked it, but what, who cares? Well, look at this. Th these are kitchen appliances. All right, so this is the fill and flavor direct response infomercial. If you don't know what direct response is, direct response is, is when there is no, there's no like middleman. They don't like, this is not like in Walmart. It's not in Target. It's just manufacturer direct marketing to consumer. And it's always insane. Do your homemade cakes look and taste the same? Old fashioned, no filling, boring and plain? Well, not anymore. Now there's the fantastic fill in flavor by Perfect Bakeware. Okay. The revolutionary cake making wonder that lets you bake, fill, and decorate. I've seen this one. It's so easy. Turn just it up. Pour in any cake mix. Lock on the magic center insert. But hold on. First of all, let's before I know people get like, stop pausing. What is this? No. I, I, this looks like cheese. This is brie? What happened? Don't pause. I'm gonna be pausing. <laughs> Alright. I want you to do an experiment with me, guys. Every time they do a black and white, look at this person screw something up, or look at how bad this looks, imagine the person is like 10 beers deep. This is just like the person is trashed. If you think like that, it's this makes sense. This person is shit-faced and they decided to make a cake. Imagine their surprise when they see tasty chocolate That's a huge inside. fucking feast. Or who's who's going to eat that? Is one of the kids going to eat this? Yeah, no shit they're surprised. It's like mom's giving us a, 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 like the whole cake. Tasty chocolate. That's so that's so much. That's way too much. With pudding inside. Chocolate or pudding. How about this s'mores cake? Stop. I eat that. With fluffy marshmallow cream. Yep. No more cramming and jamming the filling. Oh, look at our shit face. This person is. Look at our shit face. Okay. No Remember, this person, it's like three o'clock in the morning, and they know they have a pie in the fridge. And they the two or three of them in the room are like, yo, pie, right, dude? More cramming oh, let's get it. The made easy with our optional special <laughs> Wait, hold, on. hold on. Whose hands are these? What was? Oh, I thought that was a batting glove. I was like, why is this? Why is like a baseball player serving this? I thought that was a fucking like golf glove. Yeah, I just made a few cakes uh, for the boys in the locker room. Could be better than one fill in flavor, two fill in flavors. That's right, you get two for the price of two. Just pay separate processing and handling. I have a question for everybody. I had this theory since I was like 15 or 16, whatever. So when they say, oh, and if you act now, you get a second one free. Almost every single infomercial that you'll see on all these lists, that one of these videos, they did that. And was that just you're paying for two? We just say this is how much it costs for one. Is, is that that's how that works, right? That's that's the idea. Oh, and uh, remember, if you get our get this, it's you get two for, for just nineteen ninety nine. The price is nineteen ninety nine for this, but you get two. So they're ten dollars each, right? I don't it could. Maybe it's not. But I'm just saying, like, I remember that was a uh, that was a big thing. Or they'd give you other stuff. It was like, yeah, it's $39.99 for this. And they show all the commercials, they show everything, and all of a sudden they'll be like, but hold on a second. You also get the scissors, too. And the swimming goggles. And it's like, wait, did you just kind of, did you just sell me three things and just added all the prices together? That used to happen. <clears throat> all right, what about the clever tongs? Spatulas and tongs have been around forever, but try to flip and food flops. Try to grip shit face. I'm telling you, shit face. <laughs> you need clever tongs. The two-in-one kitchen flops. Try to grip. And 
<laughs> Look at how drunk this person is. Food flops. Try to <laughs> rip and food drops. Stop. <laughs> I, just, I imagine somebody sitting across the table, right? Like somebody's sitting here and it's like, like, mom, mom, ow. <laughs> They're getting like burnt. Try to grip and food <laughs> drops. Stop. You need clever tongs. Clever tongs lifts them all. Flip potato cakes fast and easy right in the pan. Slide all right, you went, all right. Nuggets with ease. That's and count. topping off a pyramid of I had to use it. is a breeze. This is actually pretty Scoop awesome. A mountain of chicken stir fry from the pan directly to the plate or grab ground beef and place it perfectly. All right, I got a question. How many of you guys have uh, made burgers, right? And here's the thing about pans. You ready for this? Listen to this. This is important. I didn't know this, but like, you can't use certain utensils in certain pans. There's like a bunch of rules that I didn't know about. Like, oh, hey, yeah, you, uh, let me flip your burger with my spatula. Don't do that. Don't fucking do that. You're going to ruin everything. I'm like, um, what about this tool? No, that'll cause damage. You have to use this specific tool. You have to use this specific uh, silicone to, to pick that up. Okay. Oh shit, I didn't know that. I didn't know that up until like, I would say maybe like five years ago, I did not know that. Chef Andy, right. So, a product like this, I'm just gonna be very honest with you. I, I, I sport it. Because this just but works in any pan. Nobody's gonna yell at you. Mom's not gonna be pissed. You're not gonna scratch anything. You're not gonna be... Right from the Look at how much asparagus can fit in that, by the way. Look at how much asparagus without it falling. <laughs> this thing, what was this called? The clever tongs? Okay, that thing's actually fucking pretty good. I actually, like, I always, okay, even with the right tool, I will always go like this. Everybody does this, and don't tell me you don't, because it sucks. You got a spatula, and you go down, you try to get under slowly, and you end up just moving the patty to the edge of the pan, and then you end up just, like, kind of taking your finger and, like, Touching the edge and like lifting it and then letting go. I, I'm so sick of doing that. Because like the spatulas, even the silicone ones, like don't get under. They kind of just like push and slide. I, I, I think I flip half the hamburgers I've ever flipped in my life. Unless they were on a grill. Because a grill like don't matter. A, a grill like who cares if like you're using the right utensils. It's just like you just take it, you fucking flip it. You get like grease all over. It doesn't matter. But like it sucks doing that. This is how a comedian slices a watermelon. <laughs> but when it comes to doing All right, first of all, I made this reference like 2 months ago and there it is. That's a that's a that's a Gallagher reference and I'm so glad that you got to see it. Mess with that dangerous <laughs> knife is no <laughs> laughing matter. Introducing the revolutionary new Pick it up with the dash. Bro, in just secondary new perfect. Bro, what the fuck? I want watermelon, dude. Get in there. I'm fucking it's trying, dude. Matter. Sucks. Just imagine you hear the word bro like slicer. three times Guaranteed in the corner. And cut 12 perfect you in fucking do it. Don't you love fresh pineapple, but cutting it is a real chore. Just don't hold the knife like this. It's not like a fucking lightsaber. Watch. In this amazing demo, we pick 10 hard to cut fruits and perfect slicer cut 120 perfect delicious slices in less than Oh, I thought seconds. the guy did it 120 times. Save. So stop struggling with dangerous blades and stop <laughs> wasting money on pre-cut food that goes bad in I thought it was like, we made this guy do this 150 50 times and he said it was easy i think the, the i think the cutting thing is cool I, you know how many times i've actually had like a cake or something or pineapple too i'd be like pineapple just cut but i don't know i feel like i'd be kind of scared to do that wouldn't you going like this and like pushing because the thing might be wobbling around i might be kind of scared to do that all right this looks like a pretty similar realm here this is the, the jiffy fries Nothing should come between you and fresh, hot, crispy French fries. But making Never. them at home is a pain. And freezer fries just aren't the same. Now well, that was frozen. Enjoy fresh, delicious fries in a Jiffy. Introducing Jiffy Fries, the fast, fresh, easy way to make perfect French fries every day. Just load and push down to safely slice the Another, Okay, this is a small version of what we just saw. In the microwave. In just minutes, you've got hot, delicious, perfectly crisp fries. The secrets in the <laughs> Jiffy <laughs> Fries hot pot. Is that an the apple? Crisp fries. Crisp fries. The crisp fries. <laughs> Jiffy fries are a great midday snack you can make in a snap. Thinking about burgers for dinner? 
Jiffy Fries makes every dish a winner. <laughs> now, scrumptious snacks and quick, easy meals are just a <laughs> They didn't do it. They didn't. Up. Hey, excuse me. I expect the fucking cartoon crunch. Snack you can make in a snap. Thinking about burgers for dinner? Jiffy Fries makes every dish a winner. Now, scrumptious snacks and quick, easy meals are just a load, push, What the fuck? What a load of shit. Serve up some bacon Jiffy Fries for a scrumptious it's back. Jiffy Fries gets the oil and grease out of your diet. Make healthy sweet potatoes. But don't, okay. Jiffy don't you think that's the kind of sound, when you hear that sound, you go, oh! Like, that's something in there is not supposed to be, uh, that's something hard. Bacon Jiffy Fries for a... So, oop, okay. You don't, you don't move, you kind of freeze, and you go, what was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Is that a tooth? What was that? Was that in there? All right, uh, I don't know. I don't know about that one. What about the Vegetti Pro? Use the thick spiral blade for vegetable linguine. Perfect with pesto. Okay. And the thin spiral blade I get it. for a heaping bowl of angel hair pasta. But that's not all. What else? Spaghetti a potato for baked sweet potato fries. What? Slice cabbage and carrots. I thought that was an coleslaw. onion. Or okay. Slice onion rings in seconds. All right. All right. Tier. Spaghetti a giant butternut squash. <laughs> for a mouth watering feast. Make mountains. <laughs> looks like, okay, it looks like a mess. It look, I'm sorry. I, this is cool, but like, holy, this, this looks like a mess. All right, it doesn't do apples, right? Okay, so it's, it's it's like a peeler essentially, but a little more involved. I'm into it. I think it's cool. Yeah, I I probably okay. Okay, if you've had this on the counter, and I like, I can't. I like, came. You've not invited me to your house or something. And I'm like, oh hey, dude, like come on, I'll come over. I'm like, oh, I'll come over. This sounds fun. So I get there and I like put my backpack down and I put my baseball cap down, and I uh, I sit on the couch or whatever, where and and you say, oh hey, look what I got. I've got the Vegetti. I'd look over and I'd be like, whoa, let's do it. Uh, let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. That'd be fun. Like, that'd be the fun thing that we would do. And like I, that, I would have a good time doing that, I think. I think it'd be fun to do that. Why do you have a backpack on? <laughs> no, no, it's not, not a grinder date. <laughs> Okay, fuck that. I'm out of here. Everyone loves butter, but getting it out of the fridge, out of the wrap, and onto your food is a real hassle. Introducing Easy Butter, the fast, easy... <laughs> you left, okay, the problem was not the butter. The problem was you leaving your toast in the toaster for like 40 minutes. All right, that is amazing. Just open the top, slide in your butter or margarine, and give us. All right, this is fucking awesome, actually. Perfect pat size every time, guaranteed. So you'll never have to take out the knife and greasy butter. Holy shit! Or deal with yucky crumbs again. Squeeze and your pans. This is awesome. And that makes it super for sandwiches. Perfect for what? All right. Do they still make this? Am I insane for liking this? With its ergonomically designed trigger handle, Easy Butter is gentle and easy for seniors. Okay, this is, a, this is an incredible product, it. I think. I love butter. And every Easy Butter... You don't want your, your like, five-year-old daughter saying that, by the way. The you don't want to... Love it. I love butter. I, you know, we have, where's the vegetables? Where are the vegetables? Where, where, where's, the, where's the zucchini slicer? Where's the zucchini slicer? We need that back. Where's the zucchini slicer? I like this though. Easy butter for the low, low price of only ten dollars. But with your order today, we'll double the offer. All right, so it's five dollars. Butter to cut just about anything from cheese to hot dogs to bananas. Cheese? Wait, there's more? Fresh in the original. Just pay separate processing and handling. Why would you put a hot dog in there? Wait, they. Hold on. Cheese to hot. Use the second cutter to cut just about anything from cheese to hot dogs to. Hot? What? Hot? A hot dog? Why would you put a hot dog in there for little kids? But like, just it's like fun to. I mean, slicing a hot dog is not as difficult as slicing cold butter. All right, that's pretty sick. I I'd say of all the products we've seen, of like the ten we've seen, I like that one the most. Wish you had time for a delicious breakfast sandwich every morning? Yeah. Now you can with the new Easy Egg Witch. The fast, easy way to make a perfect egg sandwich in one minute. Just add an egg or two to the Easy Egg Witch. Place on the lid and pop it in the microwave. In just yeah, it's, one I'm minute, telling you, microwave you eggs were a, a big egg deal back in like the mid-2000s. Mm, great for egg whites with your favorite veggies. Spinach, tomatoes, the works. Okay. Egg witch is also great for it's easy though. It's simple. Even Whatever. Eggs are egg 
exactly right for Eggs Benedict. Nonstick means there's no butter, no oil. Make four different eggs. That was another thing, the too. They, uh, why were, were people so obsessed with this, too? Help me with this. Oh, in cooking, in oil. Who wants to do that? Olive oil is, like, fucking not bad for you. Cooking in, like, an like an olive oil? Like a light olive oil? What's... Don't, oh, and, and then think about how much oil you'll be using. What, what was, like, the, the war on fat? Like, fats. No, 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 no. Don't have those omega-3s. Don't eat them. Don't touch those. It's, look, we're gonna have a tray that all the oil drips into this tray, and then don't eat that. That's that's disgusting. How ugh, vile. Oils, like a good oil, like an olive oil, like sunflower oil, this stuff is not bad for you. It's not bad for you. It's actually it has a lot of benefits. They're not essential oil. Sunflower oil is sunflower oil is bad. I'm talking about yeah, but I said olive oil, avocado oil. You have you ever you ever cooked with avocado oil before? Have you cooked with like a good olive oil? It's like it adds to your food, doesn't take away from it. Peanut oil is amazing. Yeah, dude, what is what, what is with this war on like oil? It's dishwasher safe and stacks I don't get that. So many. But put butter all over everything. I love butter. Love burritos, but hate the mess? You fill, fold, and roll, but could never get that perfect hold. That's and true. And burritos are just not the same. That's Introducing true. Introducing Burrito That's true. Perfect, the simple, fast, mess-free way to make perfect burritos What is day. this? Watch. It's, just it's place a, a t-shirt folder. Burrito Perfect. Fill it with your favorite toppings such as rice, beans, chicken, lettuce, cheese, and guacamole. <laughs> then fold one, two, three, and you get a perfect burrito I don't know if with ease. Works. Okay, so I use. I always overfill. Burrito without the what mess. the fuck? It's so easy. The Hold whole on. Family will enjoy making their own favorite burrito. Huh? There's nothing in there. There's nothing in there. Making their own favorite burrito. There's nothing in there. There's nothing in here. Yeah, but okay, okay. Listen. When you make a burrito, I don't care who you are, I don't care what your food preferences are, I don't give a shit. You always put way too much in. Because you go, oh yeah, yeah, give me some ground beef. A little bit more, I think I need, I'm a little bit kind of hungry. And the ground beef is like a mound this high. Uh, I, I, want, I want like shredded lettuce in this, like shredded lettuce, shredded lettuce, shredded lettuce. Tomato, like tomato chunks, tomato chunks, a little bit of salsa. Oh, I gotta, is there enough, is there enough room for cheese in here? Uh, yeah, I'll put some cheese on it too. Like a lot. I want a lot of cheese on this. And then you go, this is not rolling. This is never going to roll. I'm never going to have this be a burrito. So I'm just going to put my hands underneath it and like kind of cup it and eat it like a folded pizza slice. So this product would never work for me, ever. Because there's not enough in here. I, there's not enough. I, I, kids might have fun with this though, right? If you use this for, because look, a kid's not going to, oh, hey, roll a burrito, son, that's four years old. They're gonna be like, I, my head, ah, and they're gonna start fucking crying. And it's gonna be a disaster. So I mean, like this, could be, you can make like little pancake pastries and burritos and stuff. Be fine, right? I can see it. Hi, Mark Gill here with the. And first of all, we got first of all, this is important. We got Mark Gill here, which is automatic. Like this product, I'm interested already. Already, right off the bat. Hi, Mark Gill here with the Chop Magic. You're gonna love the way this beauty can chop, mince, slice, and dice in just seconds. Chopping vegetables the old way takes forever. Yeah. It's tough work and such a mess. Yeah. Well, not with Chop Magic. Okay. Go ahead. Chop a whole onion in one second. Mm -hmm. No odor and no tears. Okay. Julienne, pepper, squash, and zucchini in just three seconds. You got it. It's a stir fry that makes other choppers cry. And it's it's safe too. It's strong enough to go through solid sweet. All right. So here's why the other thing where it was the the big like Dark Souls wheel. Like weapon, like, like pushing that down with the blades and shit. This is has safety in mind. You d you get it on the blade. You you line it up, and you're not gonna touch it. It's not gonna. You'll the little prongs up top. That's good. I like that. I mean, they're all cubes though, right? The, if you talk about you like presentation wise, it, everything is a ham cube. Everything. Everything is a ham cube. So, I mean, presentation-wise, maybe not, but practical? I think so. Somebody called me an infomercial centrist. You can say it sucks. I Did you not hear me talk about the fucking microwave one? The one with the eggs? I was like, nah, I'm not, I don't think so. What do you mean infomercial centrist? 
Everything's stored. I'm, t I'm, give I'm being honest and being very stolen, thorough. Which makes it the I'm being very thorough. Saver. Plus, it's all dishwasher safe. Now, during this exclusive... Yeah, but nobody... Offer, nobody... Dishwashers, nobody uses dishwasher. Call now, and as a bonus... We'll I use my dishwasher. I've run my dishwasher. Because otherwise, it'll get gross. I wash by hand. I don't like that idea of take. Oh, yeah, there's like a bunch of fucking like saucer and like mess on my plate. Just stick it in here and turn the water on. No. I don't like the dishwasher. I don't like it. And you know, I also I don't like the dishwasher. All the people question marking me right now. So you enjoy putting like your dishes in this thing. And then you, like for like at least one to two fucking hours, you hear... It's fucking obnoxious. It's obnoxious. And it lasts for an hour. An hour. Two fucking hours of this. You can... I, I, I can wash a whole fucking sink of dishes in 20 minutes. Dishwashers are just loud, annoying. They take way too long. A bunch of water. No, 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 no. Sometimes I'll use it if I need to. You know? But no, never. Sounds like your dishwasher sucks. Your dishwasher's broken. What are you talking about? Your dishwasher's fucked up. That's impossible. All right, what about the Go Grill? Everyone loves food cooked on the grill. Yep. Family gatherings that give us a thrill. But most grills are too big and bulky <laughs> to carry around. Who wants to use that rusty old grill on the park grounds? Wouldn't it be great to have a grill that goes... <laughs> Holy shit! Grill on the park Can you imagine seeing somebody do this? Most grills are too big and bulky. <laughs> you don't want to um uh, you try to load your backyard grill into the trunk of your car <laughs> where are you taking this where are you taking this and who wants to use that <laughs> the bugs the old grill on the park but honestly i yeah no wouldn't it be great to have a grill that goes anywhere with you well now you do Introducing the Go Grill. Okay. A foldable portable grill that travels anywhere you go. This spacious grill has a five T-bone capacity. The Go Grill is so compact it folds. All these sound effects. Long, Thirteen inches. Go Grill is spacious. Grill has a five T-bone. Okay, you know your product is really kind of just boring. Where you can't just show it. You have to have like lasers and whooshing sounds. Bone capacity. The Go Grill is so compact, it folds to only 18 inches long, 13 inches wide, and just- Or, I gotta give the credit to the editor here. The person editing, I would love, God, if I could have, if I could pick like a job that I think would be perfect. Sitting in the editing room, and just kind of laughing to yourself, and being like, yeah, I'm gonna put, yeah, I'm gonna put like whooshing sounds here. It's gonna be funny. You, I guarantee you they do that. An inch and a half deep. The sleek There's no way they don't. Weighs just eight pounds. That sounds like a go fun grill, like thing to do. Any, it's a must for camping, or, or when you go RV, okay. and it's perfect for the boat. When Into you the go boat. Fishing. This low-profile fold-away grill tucks away almost any. Oh, I got a bite. Hey, hold on a second. I got I got four chicken breasts on a grill. Hold on, out. Oh, you went in the water? Oh, we're in a rowboat. Be careful. The Go Grill can handle a full man-sized rack. The Go Grill will feed your full man size. Oh, grill can handle uh, full, full man, man size. size. We got man sized portions. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's the whole rack, which you'll eat maybe a third of it, and then be like, I don't really want any more of this. And uh, full man size portion, then you throw it away. Ah, uh, man size though. Make sure that's for men. Okay, if I was at a barbecue. And I walked up to the person that was like, you know, operating the grill, like the, the grill master. I was like, oh yeah, I'll tell you, uh, I guess, uh, uh, are they ready? Yeah, oh yeah, they're ready. You want a man-sized portion? I'd be like... No. Oh, I sure! It's like four patties. Like, no, I don't want them. No, just can I just have a regular one? Can I just have a regular hamburger? Just regular steak. Like, I don't want a man-sized portion. I don't, at home. I don't you thank you. I will give a positive here. Here's the one positive. There are tons of portable grills. There are. There's tons of them. A portable grill is actually not a... It's, it's actually pretty cool. I would actually rather cook at my home on a portable grill than the huge, 
gigantic grill that needs a bunch of maintenance. So I would actually rather one of these than like a real huge grill. I don't know, that's just like a lot. I also don't like propane. It scares the shit out of me because it's just a, a fucking bunch of gas pressurized. You know how I feel about like pressurized gas and stuff. So I don't like using propane. I like charcoal and charcoal is a mess. That crumbly meatloaf of pain to serve? Do you hate all the Holy oil, shit. grease, and fat it cooks in? There's got to be a better way. Hi, it's Mark. Hate all... Did you... Is it, why is there a, more than like two pizzas worth of grease here? Oil. What's going on? Hi, it's Mark with the perfect meatloaf pan. The new non-stick way to bake, lift, and serve delicious meatloaf. Watch. Just prepare your favorite Mark. loaf. With perfect meatloaf, those same nasty fat drippings stay at the bottom of the pan and out of the dough. Oh the my god! Fat. Meatloaf but it's sucks. But not just for meatloaf. Bake sticky pecan rolls that Meatloaf right sucks. Out of the pan it just does. There's only one meatloaf I've ever had that I liked, and it was my mother's and meatloaf. And Nobody else makes it as good. And I'm, I'll tell you, let's be really honest with each other here. I don't like your mother's meatloaf. I like my mother's meatloaf. Nobody likes another mother's meatloaf. I don't like your mother's meatloaf. I don't, I'm like, no, nah, I don't like this. But if my mom makes it, it's like, mom, it's fantastic. Why is that? But I'm not done. Call right now and receive this amazing guide knife. Adjust to your desired size and slice. Thick or thin, you'll always win. That's, I like that. $20 value, free. But I'm not stopping there. Call or click right this minute and we'll double your order. Just pay separate. <laughs> Hold on a second. I need it. We gotta get, we gotta get that. Dollar value free, but I'm not stopping there. Collar click. That was, that was like violent. Here's some inside information from Betty Crocker. It's no, 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 don't tell me, don't tell me. Don't tell me. I don't want to know this insider info. Like what I, I, I what if I want to buy like shares in Betty Crocker? Don't fucking tell me this. Hey, I got insider info on, but don't fucking come near me. Get away from me. Hate boring desserts that just fall flat. Try There's only one. A hat. What? Huh? Did you say a hat? That's right, a hat. Introducing the Brownie <laughs> Derby, the incredible brownie bowl maker that looks like a hat. This, in my opinion, 100% what I believe was a different product. That somebody on the board was just like, can, you, can we fill it with brownie mix? I think so. This is, I don't, this look, this seems like a bizarre product. But first of all. Hate boring desserts that this is not a boring dessert. This is not enough for three kids. If there were three brownies on this plate, they would be cheering. That's right, a hat. Introducing yeah! the, the Five Nights at Freddy's thing. That looks like a hat. Watch. Just fill with any what the fuck? But who cares? Wow. Tiny bowls won't do. But big <laughs> bowls <won't laughs> but, but our man-sized brownie bowl. Also, another thing that I have an issue with. They always show... I don't think this brownie was $80. Um, I would be surprised if this was a, it was just like a 80, like 50 to $80 brownie, unless you're at like the fucking weed store. Is this an edible brownie? But you can tip your hat and get two brownie dirt. Well, dad, you sent in the wrong footage because, uh, that is $20 for it. I mean, that's not out of the ordinary. I don't think. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Billy Mays. Billy Mays. Ah, oh, fucking legend. Big city slider station. Big the city sliders. An easy way to press and cook delicious sliders. Those restaurant mini burgers everyone loves. No more squishing and squashing or flipping and flopping. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Just fucking go god! Press and cook right on your stove. The unique wait, it, wait, wait, wait. So you never have to flip them. What? In just two minutes, you'll have five mouth-watering sliders. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Everybody back up and everybody shut up for a second. This is not... I've seen products like this. Where you... Oh, look, you make perfect little patties. But then you have to cook them. This is... A pan. You press and cook right on your stove. 
The unique design no way. Both sides at once, so you never have to flip them. What? And in just two minutes, you'll have five mouth-watering sliders. Use dinner rolls, potato rolls, any bun. You can double or triple stack them and watch your family attack them. Top with pickles. Yeah, right? yeah. Ketchup or cheese, big city sliders are sure to please. The double-sided non-stick surface is so slick, not even Burnt on cheese. On cheese will stick. Whether it's ground beef, chuck or sirloin, just scoop, press, and cook. No flipping and no hassle. Make healthy turkey. And they always make the pans look so dirty. And join the craze with me, Billy Mays. You can also cook them on a bed of onions or that classic diner. Oh, that's or fucking the awesome. Station is the ultimate burger press to load the grill in the and watch this. On Bagel sandwiches? Morning, five perfect egg sandwiches in an instant. Bro, I'm oh, sorry. I would want this. It. I'd get it. How about shake and take my blend buddy? That's a long name. Okay, a blender's actually our pain in the ass, so I will give this one a little bit of time here. Hate fussing with the blunders of blenders, especially when you're on the go, then uh -huh. searching for a portable cop and messy cleanups. Well, now there's Blend Buddy. Delicious blueberry smoothie is ready to go. Then simply Oh, then it's a container. A delicious meal on the run. This yeah, but the magic bullet did this. Easy and the magic bullet spills. did this already. Even the mixing blades are attached, so there's no extra parts. The large 16 ounce container will satisfy the biggest thirst. Man sized. Safe, and not only is it man sized, but look at this. This man's out working. Construction. Not that you would, but even solid rock is turned into a fine That's powder. broken now. Blend Buddy is perfect for executives with busy schedules. Executive. A must for mom. Blend Buddy is <laughs> Look at this guy's for, fucking ring. Even solid rock is turned into right, is a Is that a wedding powder. ring? Blend what is that? Like, that's a that's a huge ring. Is that a wedding ring? No, it's not, right? It's got, what, what side does a wedding ring have to be on? That's a man-sized wedding ring. Buddy is perfect. For executives, with <laughs> executives, I love its executives. Oh, it's perfect. It's perfect for an executive with a briefcase. Where is this executive, by the way? Does he live here? Is this another person's house? Is your is who's the exec? Oh, per perfect for the executive. Because they've shown us the same people the whole time, right? Is this is this is this the same family? They said it's the same kitchen. Oh no, it's not the same kitchen. Okay, I thought it was the same kitchen. I thought it was the same kitchen. Because I was gonna say, are they all living in the same house? Because they showed like construction worker guy, executive, mom. I'm guessing, right? Like I, I, I thought they were all gonna be in the same house. And feel great. Just mix, twist, and go. Store-bought smoothies are so expensive. Regular the Sims. Even delicious desserts and your Hulk size. Look like oh this. my Real God! Lives up to its name. The it Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan's ultimate grill. This is George it's Foreman. Because it's extra large interchangeable plates easily transforms your Hulk Hogan grill into a skillet. This is George Foreman grill. The Hulk Hogan Pizza grill. Press. Pizza oven. What? Quesadilla maker. A buffet warmer. And then some. That's twelve hundred dollars worth of specialty appliances in just one countertop. Rebel. I thought he was gonna say twelve hundred appliances. <laughs> okay, what is it? What is it? This is a fry. No, this is like a serving tray. Twelve hundred appliances. We better get like a thirty-second monologue of him looking right in the camera. Let me tell you something, brother. You, the Hulk Hogan grill. Is he got the healthy? Yeah, I please do it. Where is he? It's that easy. Hulk Hogan's He's not here. Apartments, dorm rooms, RVs, boats, and so much more. That's it. That's it. That's it. No way! The what the fuck? Grease, He's just a gif in the corner. And they showed him biting into a hot dog. He didn't do anything. He didn't do anything but this. He just, <laughs> he just bit into a hot dog. Is, maybe there's a 30 minute version? I hope there is, because holy shit, that's so funny. But even if this is the short version, you're not gonna have Hulk Hogan do anything besides bite a hot dog in your two, three minute spot? Your three minute spot has him biting a hot dog. You gotta have him being like, oh, this is, I'm telling you something, this is really good, it's very flavorful, very healthy. You gotta get him to talk. 
That's it? Take some avocados, onions, cilantro for a full bowl of guacamole in just five seconds. That was the way more than five the seconds. Three ultra sharp stainless steel blades that chop, mix, and prep in just one step. Thick, medium, or finely chopped with fresh Mex Express, <laughs> the so choice fun. is yours. Is Make a spicy stupid. guacamole, mouth watering mango salsa. Creamy chili cheese dip, flavorful black bean dip, even make fresh, healthy hummus. And what the fuck? Nothing's better. Burritos with I can't, man, this is fucking to so tacos. dumb. Make free. They Just keep make playing the same. Oh, it's killing me. They keep playing the same 10 minute clip of the same 10 minute music file. It's like, oh, come on, man. You don't got anything else to put here? It's so leftovers. fucking right dumb. And we'll double the offer free. Just pay separate processing and handling. And to really spice things up, you'll also get our Tortilla Express free. Microwave moist steam <laughs> tortillas in just seconds that stay hot for up to an hour. You get it all. Two fresh Mex Expresses with storage lids. <laughs> Who's that? Guys, and the Tortilla Express for just nineteen ninety nine. Yeah, all right, what if it might be fun now. if it do it to work with the kids? Just we found the Hulk cut. Plus you'll also <laughs> Good, I'm happy about it. Store. Paid advertisement for Hulk Hogan's Ultimate Grill, brought to you by TriStar Products Incorporated. All right, let's go. Hey guys, I'm Hulk Hogan. Stay with me for the next half hour. I'm gonna show you my latest invention, Hulk Hogan's <laughs> my <Ultimate> invention. Grill. <laughs> Brother. <laughs> Finally, a grill that lives up to its name. Hulk Hogan's Ultimate Grill. It's the ultimate because okay, it's they... extra large interchangeable plates easily transforms your home. You know, they definitely grill. were just like, hey, Hulk, Hulk Hogan, we're going to run the camera for three minutes and just do whatever you want. Do like three or four promos. Just, you could literally say anything you want and just kind of flex and shit. And we're just going to put you around the commercial. And then I think he's in person here. This is important. To a skillet, panini sandwich press, he made this. pizza oven, and then some. No, he did not. Grill cooks with George Foreman pressure. did Just 10 years before this. Hey guys, notice this. These aren't ordinary burgers. These are Hulk sized burgers. And we are going these to are, show you these how are men. pizza is my favorite. Really? Well, what we did is we went out and bought this pizza maker. It takes about 30 minutes. It's a little bit faster than heating up your whole oven. But pizza it takes maker? Minutes to no, make thank a pizza. You. Take a look. And yeah, we got this pizza maker from some shitty infomercial. Pizza? So I uh, take a look yeah, at our pizza. infomercial. Ours is better. I think it's very interesting. God damn it. You know, one thing that I wish would ever, ever happen to me in my life. <clears throat> they used to do in infomercials these, look at, we're in a mall. Come try it and come check it out and be on TV. God damn it, man. I wish, I wish I could, if I, so, if I ever see this, ever. I am running up to that fucking thing and being first in line. I want to be that, I want to be the weird guy that's just like, mm, it's so fresh. It's delicious. Better than, better than grandma makes. I want to do that so bad. Even if it sucks. I love grilled cheese. But you told me you had a problem with it. I it's never mad. get the center finished the same time the outer edges do. And I always make a mess and I always burn them. Well, how about if I told you we were going to make these grilled cheese sandwiches, four of them, oversized, by the way, as you can see, in about 30 seconds, all right? 30 really? seconds. Now, the way we're going to do that is we're going to use pressure. You give it a press. It locks in place. 30 seconds. Are you, are you counting? 30 seconds. <laughs> all right. Um, well, how about... A a, but a, a grilled cheese is like... A grilled cheese is very easy to make. It's very easy. What is he saying here? Problem with it. I can never get the center finish the same time the outer edges do and I always make a mess and I always burn them well but <laughs> I fucking love Hulk Hogan I'll, always right? man now, always gonna... you burn it every time I'm imagining this is like oh well I want to make a grilled cheese sandwich I burnt it again I burn it every time you turn the heat down the pressure. Mm -mm -mm. instant replay just in case you want to see those grill marks Two packages I wanted someone to explain to me here. What is the obsession with grill marks? Oh, but look, it's got grill marks on it now. Who fucking cares? Who cares? Dude, it's a hot dog and it tastes exactly the same, but this time it's got grill marks on it. Okay. Uh, who cares? Why is that such a huge, huge selling point? Yeah, it's somebody just said it's just a racing stripe. The grill marks on a real grill, it's like, okay, you're cooking on uh, a fire or pro with propane or 
you know, charcoal is having just like a grate that makes marks on your food doesn't make it cooked on a grill. Like doesn't make it cooked on like a charcoal grill. It's like pretending. I love the Hulk Hogan Ultimate Grill. I cook shrimp and steak and it's done quickly. There's enough for everybody. We take it to the beach, we take it to a cabin. And the and it's done quick and steak and it's done He's not sure about this. Quickly, there's enough for everybody. <laughs> Fresh ingredients that I bought for a third of the price of pizza parlor pizza. Well, I love to make. Oh, listen, they, it's the Sims. Sims. They, they all live in the same house. Hulk Hogan grill. It's big enough. It's got a wide surface. I can put two large paninis on there, and it's done in like three minutes. We cooked a whole. <laughs> Everybody lives in grill. the same house. How big is this house, dude? I'm sorry. Only so many people can use the Hulk Hogan grill at eight o'clock in the morning. Big or small, open or closed, fresh or frozen, Hulk Hogan's ultimate grill does it all, brother. Thank you so much. You're a champ. Let's go practice our wrestling now. Come oh, on, I need some help. Hulk is gonna go wrestle this guy? He's gonna go kick the shit out of this guy. Hulk Hogan's ultimate grill does it all, brother. Yeah, Thank like, is so he much. saying that? We're a champ. Let's go practice our wrestling now. Come oh, on, I need some help. Is he saying that to production? Like, guys, I'm gonna need help uh, over here on the right. Like, he's not, uh, he's talking to production. Stir and toil and watch out. It's sure to make a mess. Then you strain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that first is trash. not a choice. And you strain. Make a mess. Then you strain. <laughs> Why would you dump the whole thing make out? A mess. It's balancing. It's balancing. On the edge of the sink. And you dump the whole thing into it. This person is trashed. Oh, or they're yeah, wicked high. Making pasta's not a choice. And the thing is, what they should show is they should show like the per like they should cut to the persons like over here, and just have him be like with these like red eyes, and have him just go. I don't care, and then reach into the sink and like put it back into the strainer and put it on a plate, right? Because I mean, come on, the best pot pie maker. Oh, yep. Let's go. There's nothing better than make with holiday. Why is he on the phone? My best pot pies. Watch. Wait, why delicious. did he call in? Why did Chef Tony call into the infomercial? He's calling from prison. There's nothing better to make with holiday leftovers than my best pot pie. <laughs> he had to finish the commercial. He's contractually obligated to finish the commercial. Do you love delicious mouth-watering hot pot pie? But store-bought pot pies have lots of potatoes and fills you uh, that's not face. He that seems like a really nice guy. He really I'm does. Chef Tony from Best Pot Pie. <laughs> now you can enjoy homemade pot pies as good as grandma's, and it's faster than frozen. Watch. Just use the press cutter to <laughs> package the homemade dough to form the bottom. Spoon in your favorite. <laughs> Why? But what? That was so weird. Veggies. Why have a call-in segment? What the fuck? Crust? That was a close call. What? The side mirror was clear, but that car is invisible in your blind spot. You almost wrecked. <laughs> Holy Turning shit! A flash could leave you in a dangerous crash. <laughs> what the Finally, fuck are you doing? Zone, the amazing fully adjustable wide-angled mirror that virtually eliminates blind spots around your truck or car. Look, clear zone mirror reveals this. It's a truck second in your mirror, spot, but the factory mirror doesn't show that big truck at all. That's dangerous. Wait a minute. Watch. To demonstrate, we surrounded this car with other large vehicles. Factory mirrors only have a limited field of view, but clear zone clearly reveals those vehicles hidden Whoa, in the car's okay. Spot. But it's how what if it falls off? Widens your field of view. Get clear zone and drive with confidence. Clear zone. That looks like it's just kind of clipped on. Design lets you see three lanes of traffic, revealing what's in your car's blind spots. It couldn't be easier. Clear zone mirror installs in seconds. Adjust and you're ready to go. Look again. Clear zone instantly reveals Reveals All right, if that, in your they made it look like you're putting a webcam on top of your monitor. If that's secure, then that, that, that that's like kind of helpful, isn't it? You say, Clear Zone makes parking in the tightest spots a breeze. Back in with only inches to spare and let Clear Zone steer you clear. In no, situation. Built to last, clear no, honey, you can't pull. You, that's too small of a space. I got this. Is what are you talking about? I got the Clear Zone. No, it's not big enough. It's not, you know, you're going to hit something. Please don't, just easy, easy. You go, no, 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 no. Turn, turn the wheel, turn the wheel, turn the wheel. And then they fucking crash into the garden gnome. The stream machine? What's the stream machine? We need to know. That 
was your favorite song. Now for some annoying commercials. <laughs> Introducing Stream Machine, the clever little gadget that connects to your phone or music player and streams music right through your radio. Wait, what? Imagine being able to enjoy all your favorite songs broadcast with crystal clarity. Wait, it's a... With Stream Machine, you can. Because it's oh, you... in your radio and makes you the DJ of your very own FM station. Here's how it works. Tune your radio to any unused FM station, adjust the numbers on the LCD staticky. display to match, and you're done. That radio station now plays only what you want to hear. What? No, no way. Other wireless solutions are complicated to set mm -mm. up and can cost hundreds of dollars. No. But Stream Machine is so simple to use. Just plug, tune, and play. And it can be yours today for just $14.99 through this incredible TV offer. So why suffer listening to other radio stations? We're just about to play your favorite song. But first, some more annoying commercials. Oh, come on. When you can create your own commercial-free radio station this with Stream pissed. Machine for just $14.99. This angry. HD Vision Ultra. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be a fucking doozy. There's HD no vision. It's crystal clear. It's, they're amazing. HD quality. They're talking about <laughs> HD vision ultras, the brand new sunglasses that give you our trademark high definition color and. Now you're probably wondering why our commercial is not in HD. It's actually in HD 480p. Reduce glare and increase color and clarity like no other glasses you've ever worn. These are amazing. And these do the job. Everything just pops. It's incredible. Other glasses just make things dark. Oh, the world well, looks HD like shit. Vision lenses enhance colors, and they have great styling. I got thumbs up from the wife. I'll take them. <laughs> I can see how blue the ocean is, the sky, every cloud. I mean, really, it's unbelievable. They're really very cool. These sunglasses are just phenomenal. Ah! Excuse me, cut that one. These are HD glasses. Price. As a special offer, they're not sunglasses. Giving away HD Ultras for just $10. Wait, <laughs> hold on, wait, 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 wait. We're, we're giving away Ultras for just $10. So you're selling them for $10. You're giving them away for $10. All right, the potty patch. Is this just like a little patch of... Like grass? Is your house one big doggy bathroom? Tired of cleaning and replacing carpets and furniture? It's <laughs> that guy's not happy. Cleaning and replacing All right, this guy has been to this house like a dozen times a month. This carpet cleaner's getting sick and tired of coming to this house. Furniture? It's time to join the millions of happy potty patch owners. Now dogs have a safe place to relieve themselves. <laughs> He's not peeing. The These, this is not real pee. This is edited in piss. Watch as we pour a full quart of water right on the potty patch. <laughs> Why would your dog be... Leaving the synthetic King that much. Potty patch is also available in a big dog. <laughs> potty patch is also oh, available for humans. Rugs, floors, and furnishings looking like this. Just like some guy like get out of bed and just like fucking today. pissing into this. A man-sized piss. If you've ever had to clean out your clogged shower drain, then you know how gross and disgusting that clog Holy of wet shit. Hair can be. Well, never again. Oh! The solution is finally here. Introducing Drainwig. With Drainwig, you'll never Who's have to worry what the about the drain again. Why was it? Simply leave the Why was it like it? Drain, and every few months, you just pull it out and dispose of it. You don't have to touch the yucky. Oh! Stop! Stop important. showing this to me. It just takes seconds to pull out. And <laughs> oh my God! Somebody's. Oh, oh, I got. Milk. I don't want to say it out loud, but I'm gonna. Somebody said it probably. Somebody said it probably smells like puke. <laughs> a full three month no questions asked money back guarantee that's fucking disgusting so don't wait that nasty hairball that's fucking disgusting like imagine if he's dollars. just like Train he's like oh money and <laughs> that would have really sold it for me log on to the website. <laughs> he lifts it up he's like so close he just goes <laughs> hi mark gill here with plumber's hero the one product oh not this thing just press and unclog the mess. Watch again as Plumber's Hero completely annihilates the clog. I feel like this would blow up my sink. I would be scared. Calling a plumber is expensive. And if there's water on the floor, you can't wait anymore. Just press and unclog the mess. Holy shit, dude. That's so much pressure. I would feel like I would do that and it would just, the sink would blow up my face. That's scary. Plumbers, it's great for toilets, sinks, tubs, and shower drains. And works on This is crazy. Plumbers. There's never a convenient time for a clog, so don't let it ruin your plans. Reach oh, shit, we were just about to go out. Ah, uh, no, wait, hold on. Honey, you're telling me that, like, the fucking Mondo massive dump I just took before we leave the house? Oh, great. Now we can't go to the opera. Oh, now we can, thank God. 